Welcome, my wonderful viewers and subscribers. The up the boss, Clarity Boss himself, representing for the Clarity Flex to make my viewers and my subscribers. Actually, I'm up by pan side, so this is weird. SNG start their section of the road construction or road improvement on the St. Thomas leg of this highway. Now, this section of road, you see that they have been the markings already. This section of the road was given to another contractor, but for some reason, I don't know the reason, but they actually lose their contract, right? So check put it in the um, curve wall, their water. Anyway, as I was saying that they lost the contract and so SNG took over this section along with checks. Right? So this is a section that is call it 90 odd percent complete where the road surface is concerned. So they start from out by the Ponsad area, go back to the green wall. Right. So this is not originally SNG um, work, but they come on board and do everything out here. Then I'm going to take you from Green Wall to Murrent Bay, where that was the original SNG um, section. But what I want you to see is that this entire stretch from out to the pond side to Murrent Bay already have on asphalt smooth sailing so it's for us now to take our time and drive on the road it is pretty the road is set the right and proper way the road not used to them driving here as yet so make we just take our time look at it so this was a section that last people you see you can see the block this section just do in the week today is saturday the 13th of i call it again april 2024 so I'm just showing you the progress of the work, the improvement of the work taking place on this section of the island. Jamaica, this is St. Thomas. The world, this is St. Thomas. So St. Thomas, no. People normally say St. Thomas is the F word. No, I don't say that. St. Thomas is the best parish. Look at our beautiful road. Taking you into the Murrent Bay taking you closer to the Murrent Bay Urban Center and I uploaded a video yesterday showing the Murrent Bay Urban Center which is supposed to be completed in, in September of this 2024. And so this is what taking place right now my viewers and my subscribers. Nice decent road. And remember we always ask the drivers, pedestrians, please let us use the road in the right and proper manner. Keep the road clean. I saw a lot of garbage thrown out of windows by vehicle, passengers in vehicle, drivers of vehicle, pedestrians. Let us try our, our best and keep the place clean. This is our parish. And let me tell you something now. I was at the Murray Urban Center Thursday with the Prime Minister and other persons. And believe me, that place are the best in Jamaica right now. When it finish, come September, you will see all pretty. So you know a lot of people gonna come Saint Thomas, visit Saint Thomas, just for the urban center and just to see the road all pretty and also to go to other places in Saint Thomas. So we have to try our best and try and keep the place clean and friendly. Let us try and keep St. Thomas people friendly. Right? Look at the road. Who would expect this to be happening to St. Thomas? We have pretty road, line markings, and you're going to see a surprise coming up before the video ends. A surprise. I'm not going to tell you the surprise yet until I reach where it is taking place for you to see that big things are going for St. Thomas. Viewers and subscribers, 
I'm always out there trying to get the update because what? I'm a nation builder. I'm trying to show you how St. Thomas is building. This is not about, you know, people abash me and say, I do work for P and I do work for J. No, I do work for St. Thomas, the development of St. Thomas and Jamaica on a wider scale. So, so out of green wall, my viewers and my subscribers, this is where it ends, yeah. And this now is where SNG original section of the road improvement in St. Thomas starts. Look at it. All this is a different section, you know. This is, is, a, is a new alignment, road alignment. Then take it off and close to the sea and put it here, over here, look. See the old road on the right hand side, see it? Look over there. So this, give SNG some thumbs up. SNG really do some good work in the center mass. I'm not telling a lie. All the contractors, them doing their best. But SNG stands out among the others. I'm not getting paid to be saying this, but believe me, I'm on the ground from day one when the work start and I can see SNG doing them thing right and proper way. Yes, my viewers and my subscribers. And remember now, viewers, if you don't subscribe to the channel yet, please hit the subscribe button and the post notification and the, so you can be notified whenever I upload a video. So I'm in button be right now going into the white tasses. And remember, watch color. We, we all wanted to see what is going to happen to Roche Collet. Now, I'm approaching the Roche Collet section, my viewers and my subscribers. Look at the road, it's pretty. No stopping. Just simple, take your time and drive. Look, see it? We don't stop from, from the start of the video now. It's just continue driving non-stop. Look at the road, it's pretty. So I'm welcome all of you, wherever you are. Visit St. Thomas. Yes. Nice parish. A lot of things for you to see. We have beaches, we have rivers, we have mangoes, we have wonderful people in St. Thomas. And again, let us try and keep our St. Thomas clean. If you are a visitor to St. Thomas, don't show anything outside the road. Keep your garbage. And when you reach a been disposed of it properly. Remember, you know, I'm doing this to help build St. Thomas. Now we stop here because they're putting on a second, second layer of asphalt in the Roche Gully area. Right? So, them getting the work done before the end of the year. Right, my viewers and subscribers, yes, so it's it. They're out there now putting on the second layer in this road school. Remember, people used to say this at the Doppel Shore, the Arrow movie part of St. Thomas Road Development? Look at it. Look at it, my viewers and subscribers, and tell me how you feel about road school. Look at it. And remember, you know, I appeal to the drivers all the time. Make we take the time and drive. We don't want to lose no more vehicle. We don't want to lose no more people. We don't want to lose no more nothing at all. Make we take with them. See, paving continuous. They're out here now in Roach Gully. Look how Roach Gully come a long way. Yes, my viewers and my subscribers. And remember, people keep saying about the, the sidewalks and the, the garbage and the, um, the dirt and things like that. Remember, what they're trying to do is to complete the road surface itself, then then finish up the other sections. Okay. But this is road Gully going into White Houses and SNG doing this section, my viewers and my subscribers. So I'm just highlighting um, the SNG section of the road improvement between Panside and Mark B runabout. And they got two, they got one package, then the other contractor could not manage there, so they actually got it from the other contractor and so look at it my viewers and my subscribers no stopping tell me first let me stop it yes i stop because they are doing some work 
but I'm talking about the, the driving condition of the road, the road surface itself. How you feel about this going from Pansai to Marantville? It's smooth sailing. You might have a look up section that need a little touch up, yes, but look at it. Road marking. Yes, my viewers and my subscribers. This is what's taking place right now, right now, right now. As it relates to the um to the road development in St. Thomas right now, my viewers are telling me. So St. Thomas, welcome all you people who want to come to St. Thomas and say that the road is bad. No one. Look at it. Look at it. Okay. Give a thumbs up to S and you know, man. Then do a good job. Look at white horses. Remember white horses all the time. Or you see what they look at it. You're going through wet houses now. Easy. You get me? Yes, my viewers and my subscribers. Just like that. You know the character boss always outside. Getting the updates to give to you. And you know that the section from prospect to the borderline start. And I try to give a weekly update, like a update on Sundays on that side. And for you to see that progress also, you have to subscribe to the channel and hit the post notification bell. And so, if you them, I want you to share them with your friends and your family. And some of us have enemies. We're not supposed to have no enemies. But some of us have enemies. Share them with your enemy, enemy too. So that they can see the progress of St. Thomas, the development in St. Thomas Parish. Yes, and people and my parish, we love my parish. We love it. Yes. Yes, my viewers and my subscribers. Right. It's like oh, I am sharing sharing this with you. You can share it also with your friends and family and enemies. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. So as I mentioned earlier, I'm giving you from one side to Marant Bay runabout where SNG actually doing the work in this area so this is the latest update to this Friday to this Saturday the 13th of April 2024 right so this is the latest that taking place right now this video was done yesterday actually the 12 Friday was, was done actually Friday but today the 13th I will actually post a video. Right. So you might pass out there today, Saturday, and don't see any paving work gone. It's because this was yesterday, Friday, the 12th of April. Look at the road people. Oh my god! I'm so excited. Yes. Look at St. Thomas. Hmm? People, we want to know short out to SNG. I want you to tell me how you feel about SNG. Just comment about SNG. Yes. They want to know how you people feel about SNG, the work that SNG done in St. Thomas. All right. Remember, down, down here, so after I passed Shady Spring, too, the corner was so, was so narrow. I know they actually come back and do adjustment to that corner I know it is wider so tell me SNG not doing a good job as I said before just tell them how to feel because SNG they might watch it you know they might watch the video and they want to know how to feel about the work that they are doing just comment in the comment section how you feel about SNG work see the corner here see it? Then widen it. Realize, look. Come back and do their adjustment. Right. Then look on the road. Then analyze the situation that we will be facing. Facing. So then come back and do the adjustment so we can drive more comfortable on the road. And when they do that, they expect us to drive comfortable on the road and safe on the road and not to kill off ourselves so make we just use it properly we hear how much time to talk about that let us do the right thing so 
my viewers and my subscribers i'm coming up now to the rosedale fall area right the fall is still there people still using the fall out there but one problem i i, I have is we are at the seaside they should allow a section for the vehicle to pull off the road and park on that side so that they don't park on this side so you see the vehicle and they have a wall over here see they should lick out that wall and put it away there like that and put it so the vehicle can go over there and park instead of parking on the road and while doing that the vehicle need to park properly so that another person can come in and park also instead of blocking the whole entire section they can park properly so that another person can come in and do the right thing in then do the spot in the look of yourself in then and see the Caribbean Sea on the right hand side of the road yes see it the viewers and subscribers you know you also have to give it quite a a thumbs up now because a long time I'm out doing this every day I'm out there catching this to give to you so tell the Clarity Boss how you feel about what he is doing or what the Clarity Boss team is doing for St. Thomas, for Jamaica and for you so you can stay at home Jamaica and I'm going to take him please you understand? and subscribers just do that alright so this is out by the Russell area now going to Belvedere look white line in the road my brothers and my subscribers you realize what's taking place right now look at what is going on not shot on the road still you know well you must say road pretty so much shut it up right and as i said before i'm gonna give you a little surprise before the video ends so i'm coming up to that section right now where i will be giving you some subs a little surprise on what happened outside here so now people now coming up out this Belvedere section you have the white line but you have additional safety measures out here right now and as I go closer look you see they have the cat eyes in look you see you see the cat eyes them you right so they now put it in cat eyes out here on this section of the road they're gonna put it all along oh, this is a surprise my viewers and my subscribers this is what exactly so you see the development you see the, the beauty of St. Thomas look at this look at this area how beautiful it is you need to enjoy St. Thomas you need to keep St. Thomas clean remember now St. Thomas is going to be a tourist attraction very soon you're going to have tourists all over the world coming to St. Thomas so let us keep it clean yes it's delicate as right there people yes so as I said before, this is the latest update from out oh, by Pondside in Yellas, straight to the Marant Bay roundabout. And remember, as I said earlier to the viewers, them who, who don't subscribe as yet, if you don't do so, please go now subscribe to the channel, hit the post notification bell, share the video, comment on the video, give the video some thumbs up. And this section, when the rain falls, this section is a flood out see it and them lift the ice this side very high so i don't think it is going to flood out if even have look water on the road i don't think we're going to have too much water on the road because of the height in which they live lift this section of the road that's my viewers and my subscribers so you know some truck in front so the road kind of moving a little slow but we can pass them so we're gonna do that shortly so this is the latest update the development of my beautiful and your beautiful and our beautiful parish St. Thomas so for those of you who are not in St. Thomas you can come and visit St. Thomas you can come and take a tour to St. Thomas right now and see the beauty of this beautiful beautiful St. Thomas Parish that the normal say is the F Parish you know what I'm talking about the long word right that F word that 
the name and say about St. Thomas. I don't use that word about St. Thomas because it is my parish. So when they say that, it hurts me. Right? So I don't follow them and using that word. No. So I mean, doing the pen here right now, going in to Murrayville, and I'm coming closer to the new town of St. Thomas, which will be the Murrayville Urban Center. And as I said before, I uploaded a video yesterday showing you the visit of the Prime Minister, the speech of the Prime Minister, along with other members, and also a tour and some of the establishment that will be there at the Murray Bay Urban Centre. This section now, this section, you know, they are putting in some drainage system, a major drainage system and other things out here. So this se section now is not yet complete. So this is the only section that you won't be able to see both um, layers of asphalt. But further out, you will see two layers of asphalt on certain area because they're still working out here. Right. So now I'm close to the Murray Bay Urban Center on the left hand side of the road up by Springfield. That is where the Murray Bay Urban Center will be. And this will be the gateway for St. Thomas, the highlight of St. Thomas, the Murray Bay Urban Center. And so, this is the latest on what taking place as it relates to the development of St. Thomas. So my viewers and my subscribers sit here. On the left hand side, that is Murray Bay Urban Center over there. See the fence up, that's the entrance, right? And you can see the building going up, you can see crane over there working and everything. So this is the latest on this section of the road as it relates to SNG section of the road. And remember people, my viewers and my subscribers, please shout out to SNG road, road surfacing and material. They are the one who actually doing or who done this section of the road improvement in St. Thomas Southern Coastal Highway Road Improvement Project. And remember, this is, this is the two lane, right? Taking you from Albion to Port Antonio, but it is Dub Southern Coastal Highway Road Improvement Project. So I'm on the Boston Mountain Bridge now, going into the runabout, going into the Murray Bay. But I'll be stopping as I complete the runabout, entering the church corner, going into Murray Bay. Right. So now I'm entering this beautiful work in progress roundabout right now. Right. So my viewers and subscribers, I hope you enjoy this vlog, this journey with the Kurti Boss himself and the team as I take you on more journey on this development of our beautiful parish St. Thomas. And until we meet again, thank you to be a part of the Clarity Flex Jamaica family. Love, peace, and unity. See you in the next vlog. Out. And be safe.